Hi, my name's Katie, and in this video presentation, I'm going to talk you through the creative writing element for the CSSE exam. We're going to discuss how to write an effective creative writing piece, how to approach the question, how we can improve upon skills, and know what is expected of the student from the examiner. So how to write a creative writing answer. Planning is absolutely crucial. Without a solid plan, you are not gonna be able to write the answer to the best of your ability. When writing a story, for example, an example, there needs to be a clear beginning, middle and end structure. You must be original within your writing. So be you, think that a little bit more outside of the box. Don't go for the most obvious. Um, there is a 20 minute suggested time for, to answer both the questions. So then that's a 10 minute limit for each. And be descriptive. Use your compound and complex sentences, metaphors and similes. Don't just stick with basic one lines. How to approach the question. Understand what is being asked of you. So there is two style questions that can come up for the creative writing element and that is a topical one and being asked to write a story based around an image that you are shown. Um, with the topic one that could then be a story, it could be to write a set of instructions, it could be a diary entry or it could be a letter. So you need to understand what you need to write to be able to plan your answer. So if it's a story, you need to know who's there, what's happening, is there a twist, how's it going to end, where are we? Make sure that you are always clear with what you are writing. We don't want to be jumping up and down and from here and there. And that's why we do the plan for a clear structure that's evident to both yourself when you're reading it back and to your examiner. And how can we improve upon skills? Well, practice, practice, practice. The only way to get better at doing them is to do example and past paper questions and learn from each answer. We can then focus on specific areas that need improvement. For example, we can work on description banks if you're finding it hard to think of words to use, phrases, similes and metaphors. We can have a bank that can be used for several situations and you can incorporate them then into your writing. We can also look at working on timings so that you're not losing marks for running out of time. If you only get to answer the first question, you've essentially already lost 50% of your marks. <clears throat> and what is expected then from the examiner? You have to have your accurate spelling, punctuation and grammar. That goes without say. And your originality, like mentioned before, don't go for the obvious basic answers. Step outside of that box a little bit and really become creative. Make sure that you're answering the questions in the appropriate style. If they're looking for you to write a letter, make sure that the features of a letter are evident and both your questions need to be answered for the full 15 marks. If you would like to improve on your creating writing for the CSSE exam, please do not hesitate to get in touch either via the telephone number below or the email address. Thank you for your time. Bye bye.